What I'm doing here is I'm walking along the outer edge of where the flooding is, and this is the common flooding in this kind of event. We're looking for a place where we can get to where the water is and start dropping a pin. We decided we want to get involved with the flooding, especially with the hurricanes and so forth. We got an article in the newspaper last year about the king tide. I said to her, this looks like something we could do. And she said, yes, let's do that. So we signed up, we did the training. And last year we started in this exact same area because we live right over there. And as a result, we can map this whole side of Collie Bay all the way to the bridge and give the scientists the data they need. We had, I think the count was 437 volunteers. People that were very passionate about doing something for the environment. I live on a street that does a significant amount of flooding and over the past couple of years just living here have seen uh, some changes and wanted to kind of think of ways how can we help, how can we um, prevent some of the flooding but also predict it. I thought it was really cool that there's crowdsourcing of all different types of volunteers coming in and giving their time to just take some measurements, collect that data, and then make some predictions and move forward with some ideas from there. I really do think that people are interested in being part of the solution locally. They're seeing it on a regular basis. Here's something that they can put into action themselves and be part of the solution.